welcome to the channel. My name is Eric. This is Video X Philippines, and of course, we talk about all things Philippines here, especially nightlife. However, one really cool thing about YouTube, for me at least, is getting to meet people and not just interacting with people through social media and comments and all that stuff, which I really appreciate, but actually, like, handshake. Nice to meet you, bro. So many members have come here to Manila and like connected with me and we've had just such great times. But occasionally I meet someone that I'm actually subscribed to. And that happened just a week or so ago with Chad from CB Media. Now Chad runs a big YouTube channel in Thailand and Chad's all about cars. What's up, man? What up? Cheers. Great guy, we had a lot of fun. Talk cars, not that I'm a big car guy, but when it comes to cars in the Philippines, there is one car that I am just absolutely nuts about. And I featured it once or twice, but I'm gonna feature it again today in honor of Chad and meeting Chad and having such a good time. I told him, I'm gonna post a car video, bro. So Chad and everyone else, here we go. Of 1940s U.S. Americana wartime. You know what they used to call this bad boy? They called this bad boy the Go Devil. It is a absolute 100% relic of United States and Philippines history. Corridor War, one of nine U.S. and Willie's Jeeps on the island. And that means what are the chances General Damn legend MacArthur wrote in this bad boy. I would say that makes it on the bottom line one of nine. But how many times was MacArthur on the island? How many times did he need to be transported from the, the battery on this point of Corridor to the headquarters of another point on Corridor? I mean, really, Talaga, think about it. Better than a one of nine chance that I took a ride in this. 1940s incredible absolute 100% restoration we interrupt our program because the narrator is completely inebriated let's take a look under the hood deep that's a deep compartment you to understand the jeep one of the reasons the best foil yeah, ever okay. i'm learning about the wheelies imagine how many times do we smoke cigars in the wind how many times have we like flame? And we are one foot from the gas tank. No, we definitely understand the risk. So on the later version, like the 1950, it's called an M35A2. We gotta get all mathematical. The fueling tank, that's how you can tell the Jeep what year it is. They have a fueling tank from the outside of the vehicle to get up and get off. This first ND. Quick way, how can I tell if it's a World War II Jeep or not? Super quick, one answer. The hood. The hood. So, we call it a high hood. So, if you see a Jeep and the hood, so imagine where it curves in here. Imagine right here. It's, look at that, it's only, it's, it's called a four and a half inch. So a high hood will have a hood like this. It's almost like a foot deep. And they were the ones that were made in 19, I think 1960. They're called uh, the Mitsubishi license. They got the Mitsubishi license. So you'll see them in the Philippines all the time. You see Jeepneys, you see them all the time. Oh, it's a Mitsubishi. When you see the, we call them a, a, a it's a high hood. And low hood. When you see the low hood, this is the real deal. All right, I got two more points that makes it. Right here, bro. Watch this, real watch real this, real. bro. You got nine grill spaces. Oh, One, man. two, three, eight, four, eight. five, six, eight, seven, eight, 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 nine. Nine grill Boy, spaces and recessed. You got recessed lights. That's the other way to identify an original and 1943 release, really, bro. You can also flip it and turn the light on the engine, which yeah. is the super cool. <laughs> really? your, your hands get hella dirty. All right, here. No, no, not that, that one. This one. See, pop it. Wow, that was a simple release. Here we go. This is the Go Devil. Yeah, it's this so is this is the original all the time of the years. Go Devil, this baby. Is a, this, this is, is what won the war right here. Well, this is where you really know. This is where Ian's been talking. Is it real? Uh, yeah, check it out. All original. All right. To have a copper, this is completely. Okay, so you collect this. This is like a gold AP bust down. Save it in AP. Like, I get it, you got an AP. This is for the gold AP limited thousand runs. Bro, you can see the fucking, you can see it dripping. Bro, the, bro, copper, copper intercooler. All plugs wired, you got the, oh, oh, 
Did we do it right? Yeah, 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 yeah. Check, check the car out. That's all original. For you guys that don't know, that's what we call the Weber original. That's the, oh, we got the siren up in it. Oh, we still, you still, okay, we gotta, we gotta zoom in on this. We still, oh, we wanna go deep, Eric. I don't think they know, Eric. You ready for the depths? Oh, I'm ready. You know, Eric. You know I'm all about the Jeep. Eric, this is, I'm gonna tell you the one thing, brother man. When you see a Jeep, there's one thing that like tickles me. One. What is that? Besides the fucking engine. <laughs> ready for it? I'm ready. I'm. Even it surprised me I had it, but I know right. I have it. I'm just can't wait. There's a motherfucking oil can right there. Like the Tin Man from the Wizard of Oz. Is that what that is? Wow. Look at that shit. Like the you Tin Man it, baby. from the Wizard of Oz. Yeah, yeah. That's an original. Bro, I told you, I don't want to talk about y'all. Better if we don't talk. All right, let's roll. We got the windscreen up tonight. Yeah, we got the joints. The windscreen's up. But all I got to do is hit this button right here, and the windscreen drops right onto the hood. Well, if you want to drop the windscreen, let's nah, and then you can drop I like that windscreen. I like this. I like these original windshield wipers here. Like, that. that is the bomb, bro. That's, that's, that's where you know it ain't bullshit. All you YouTube guys are going to get it, but for the normal regular, the Jeep is awesome. We can roll up, there's no hate, no one's like, why do you have that? Everyone's like, whoa, what a cool vehicle, but how much is that worth? Uh, I don't know. Do you know? I, I have no idea. You I know what? It's cars. I've never seen that car. And so many guys and ask you all the time, uh, how much did this shit cost uh, you? And you never answer the question, and you're good about it. <laughs> I like that. That's what I like about you. You're like, I, I noticed that. I'm like, right I didn't ever answer the question. I'm like, damn. Wait, 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 quite wait, honestly, wait, 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 he's, day, my, he's my bro, and yeah. I still don't know how much this one costs. Uh, well, all you need to know is this numbers matching, all the <laughs> So, okay, that's a lot. Yeah, that that that's that's really a lot. And, and imagine, we have register. Well, hey, we have no lights, no signal lights, no backup light, no seat belts, no airbags. Oh yeah, yeah. <laughs> how do you get that registered? Don't don't. This is where we pull out of play. Don't worry about it, baby. Yeah. All right, population. Here we go. Hey, got me. So go have a problem with it, though. Dude, you know, I got a backup I mean, vehicle. Like, I don't know if you guys can see that fucking van follow us. Like you're, my, you're my boy, bro. I can't. This is I'll be honest. I don't know. If, uh, That's like private security bigger. right there. This is too big. Like, come on, bro. I, I would love this stuff. This is what flies out. And I know we got it videos, but we got it. We you know, can't let you know what I'm right. Black van behind us. It's literally security. It's like the bodyguards are in the van behind us. When we park the Jeep, those are going to guard the car. Like, this is next level hey, like, hey, heavyweight hey, shit. Hey, all right, we talking. Like, hey, really? We talking, we talking. Saturday night in the hey, Philippines. Hey, we talk, right? We talk shit. We don't talk shit. Hey. All right, let me, let me, let's sum up some numbers, right? Because we're, we're numbered guys, you know what I'm saying? All right, check it out. Back vehicle right now? Oh, we fully permitted. We got. Look at this bad boy, a VW bus in Manila. You never see this. You never see this. This is vintage. This is old school. What year is this, bro? This is a 74, and it's pristine. Look at this, man. Look at this restored shit. Like, oh my God. Dude, in like 1982, I learned to drive in one of these bad boys. This is the bomb. 
Yep. Oh, thanks, bro. Solid as fuck, man. No, I got nothing, bro. Talaga, sorry. Epic. Epic. VW bus, a 1974. Absolutely beautiful.